This is about the government. This is about credibility. This is about electronics. This is about buggy. This is about spying. This is about thievery. This is about espionage. This is about lying. This is about payoffs. This is about contradiction. This is about special deals. This is about falsification. This is about testimony. This is about wheat deals. This is about hiding. This is about dishonesty. This is about sabotage. This is about secrecy. This is about stealing. This is about hidden funds. This is about deception. This is about the White House. And this is how you stop it. With your vote. He's continuing the bombing, not to get our men out of prison, but to keep General Tu in power. And that's a price I'm not willing to pay. Let me just add one thing. One of the great problems that we've had in the leadership of this country is that we have had too many people that were unwilling to change their mind when they got new evidence. They, they were afraid they'd lose face, and so they wouldn't change. Now, I think we need a president who isn't afraid to say, I'm going to change my mind. I made a mistake. And sometimes you ought to be able to say to the people, this is not going to be popular, but this is what we're going to have to do to save our country. You have to make those hard decisions. McGovern, Democrat, for the people. The McGovern Defense Plan. He would cut the Marines by one-third. The Air Force by one-third. He'd cut Navy personnel by one-fourth. He would cut interceptor planes by one-half. The Navy fleet by one-half. And carriers from 16 to 6. Senator Hubert Humphrey had this to say about the McGovern proposal. It isn't just cutting into the fat. It isn't just cutting into manpower. It's cutting into the very security of this country. President Nixon doesn't believe we should play games with our national security. He believes in a strong America. To negotiate for peace from strength. Strength. 